Hello everybody. Are you a beginner in Python programming language? Are you not finding a proper software to start the Python programming language? And you're not getting a proper video guide for the installation of Anaconda software? Here is a video for all of you which will help you to answer all these questions. I'm Kaushik, Computer Science Faculty, Byprop School with Yashram. Before starting the installation of Anaconda software, we should know whether our operating system is of 32-bit or 64-bit. Now, there's a question to all of you, how to check the Windows property to understand whether our operating system is of 32-bit or 64-bit, okay? So now, let's start. You need to press Windows plus E here you just have to click on this PC so just right click on this PC so you'll be getting a properties so click on properties you'll be getting this particular window which will give you the complete information about the Windows property here you just have to look for system type so this system type will give you the information about whether your operating system is of 32 bit or 64 bit so once you get the information of 32 bit and 64 bit so we can start the downloading of required software for your installation so moving on to the next step you need to download the required software for the installation of anaconda so for that i'll be opening the browser and then i will browse for the required software i will be typing latest version of anaconda so here guys you just have to scroll and then look for individual edition of anaconda so click on this so you'll be getting the official website of anaconda here you just have to scroll down and then at last you will get the installer for anaconda software so you will be getting the anaconda installers here so you have three categories of operating system the first one is windows the second one is mac os and the third one is linux so find the best one for you so here in this video i will be using the windows operating system and my operating system is of 64 bit so that's why i will be clicking on this hyperlink which has got 64 bit anaconda exe file so if i just click on this so my file will get downloaded there so it will be in my right bottom corner i just have to open this exe file and then i have to double click on that particular exe file that is the second step guys so moving on to the third step in the next step i have got the downloaded exe file of anaconda i just have to double click on this particular file once i double click on this i'll be getting this welcome wizard i have to just click on next so after that as you all know the olden days the girls used to get married without seeing a boy so in the same way we say i agree without reading the agreement so we should not do that please read the agreement carefully and then click on i agree so here is a beautiful information and very important for all of you so what is that so the first one i have is just me and the second one is all user what is this so guys suppose if i have multiple users in my laptop or in my desktop so i should be able to access this anaconda software in all the accounts so in that case i will be selecting all users suppose if i want to access this anaconda software only for my account i will be just cl clicking just me so here in this video i will just select all users and then i will click on next here is the important information for me so here it will show me in which location your anaconda software is getting installed so by default it will take the c drive suppose in case if you don't have the space in the c drive you can also change by clicking on browse so you will get a question space in the sense how much i need for the installation of anaconda software guys you need 3 gb of space for the installation of anaconda software if you have 3 gb of space in the c drive you can start installing otherwise you can just click on the browse and then you can select wherever you want the location and you can start your installation now i will just go with the same path which is taken by the application and i will click on next and then after that this is very important suppose if you have already installed the python by just downloading from python.org so you are not supposed to click on this if you click on this you will get an error like this so please leave it as it is and then click on next install then after that so it will ask it will show you the progress bar for the completion of the installation process once it is complete so we will moving on to the next option 
here it shows the completion of the progress part so I will click on next then after that I just have to click on next again then if you want to read the guide you will be checking all these things suppose if you want to don't read so you can just click on finish and you can finish the installation process I will just click on finish so it will take me to the guide of Anaconda software so I am successfully completed the installation of Anaconda let me show you how it looks to open the Anaconda software so here you have got Anaconda navigator just click on this so you will get the Anaconda running on my screen so this is how it looks guys once you are done with the successful installation of Anaconda so after this a very important information for all of you so guys I will be discussing these two textbooks in detail chapter by chapter subscribe and like thank you very much